posts are not vertical yet, but at least the bases are all in line. This fence is over 100 metres in the space of about 15 20 minutes. All those posts are in line, they're not necessarily in all the way and vertical. Here's our last post before the theodolite. And just to just to demonstrate, we also have a post that we put in all the way down here, going the other way. In this uh, short presentation I've just shown you how easy it is to line up a, um, a picket fence. Um, we've got all the star droppers equally spaced. Um, you can see behind me, they're all in a line. They're not necessarily um, banged in all the way or banged in level. Um, you can also see behind me there the theodolite still sitting there. Uh, I've done an alignment of a fencing system over basically over I guess about 120 metres within the space of about I guess about half an hour. In the next short video um, I'll show you how we actually get all the uh, all the posts at the same height. Um, for the purposes of most um, fencing applications um, you notice in a previous slide that I actually indicated a, a red mark on the on the on the pickets. Now, if you've got reasonably level ground and you want the fence line to follow the contour of the ground, just bang them all into that um, to that red mark, um, and have some sort of a post level so that you can actually make sure that they're all um, all banged in vertically. But otherwise, <coughs> uh, if you've got un uneven terrain and you want them all um, in at the same level, we'll show you how to do that too.